Warfare technology has taken a drastic leap forward with the recent unveiling of the Ripsaw M5 electric drive super tank. The wholly electric and unmanned armored vehicle is opening up the doors for a new generation of tank warfare, where soldiers are no longer required to put their lives on the line in hazardous scenarios. Instead, they can remotely control a highly agile and reliable armored combat vehicle capable of performing even the most demanding operations. The tank is currently being evaluated by the U.S. Army, and if deployed, it will be capable of achieving deeds currently impossible by manned tanks. The limber tank can dash at over 40 miles per hour and traverse over a wide variety of terrains in a combat scenario, and it uses state-of-the-art drone technology to position itself strategically. What's more, its electric motor keeps the vehicle almost entirely silent, making it highly valuable for covert operations. Still, it has one unique and outstanding feature that separates it from any other vehicle of its kind. Unmanned War Machines As civilian transportation industries are rushing towards driverless vehicles, Military manufacturers are also engaged in a head-to-head -head battle to produce a new generation of combat armored vehicles with one distinct feature, no crew inside them. Under this guideline, Howe & Howe Technologies, part of Textron Systems Corporation, built one of the most promising concepts and prototypes with technology so advanced that it has already been submitted for evaluation by the U.S. Army. However, as groundbreaking and innovative as the tank appears now, the concept stems from humble beginnings. The Howe brothers started the Ripsaw project as a small family venture back in 2000 and presented a makeshift prototype at a Dallas vehicle show in 2001, where it immediately grabbed the interest of the U.S. Army. That same year, the Army ordered a prototype to be made and dispatched to Iraq, instantly transforming the Ripsaw project from a sort of hobby in a garage to a full-fledged military enterprise. The Ripsaw family of unmanned armored vehicles is designed to perform several missions, including convoy protection, perimeter defense, reconnaissance, rescue, crowd control, and explosive ordnance disposal. The vehicles have an advanced array of sensors and cameras that provide 360-degree coverage for situational awareness for the remote operator. Additionally, the operator can tap into drone video feeds that grant a bird's-eye view of the tank's surroundings. Meanwhile, a belt of M5 crowd control munitions can be fitted around the tank to break up crowds or engage personnel with flashbang effects and rubber bullets for perimeter defense or crowd control operations. One clear advantage is that the Ripsaw tanks can be effectively controlled by a soldier in another armored vehicle or at a post up to one mile away, as its weapon systems are customized to fire remotely, loading their own ammunition and even switching between different weapon types using the advanced remote armament system. The powerful remote control capabilities displayed by the Ripsaw armored vehicles allow manned vehicles to send the Ripsaw out in front of them and engage targets without exposing soldiers to unnecessary threats. The Ripsaw M5 Out of the vast array of unmanned Ripsaw applications, the M5 is the most innovative and groundbreaking iteration of the unmanned vehicle family. The M5 was revealed to the world in October of 2019, and its features were so impressive and unprecedented that by January of 2020, the U.S. Army had awarded Howe & Howe a contract for the Robotic Combat Vehicle Medium Program. Howe & Howe Technologies was tasked with delivering four Ripsaw M5 prototypes to be thoroughly tested to measure their feasibility to be included in an unmanned manned armored combat vehicle program by 2022. The Ripsaw M5 outperformed its previous versions, as it can reach speeds of more than 40 miles per hour and has a much higher acceleration, mobility, and maneuverability thanks to its primary electric motor. Also, the automated turret is faster and more responsive, making target acquisition significantly more straightforward. Armed with a 30mm autocannon and a pair of anti-tank missiles, the vehicle has enough firepower to contend with other current armored vehicles on the battlefield and its standard armor package can withstand 108mm rounds. Still, an optional add-on would allow the vehicle to repel much higher calibers. Overall, the M5 Ripsaw is one of the fastest dual-tracked armored vehicles in the world, 
and it is also one of the only current unmanned solutions in this segment. The exoskeleton of the M5 tank is a unique patented tubular structure based on a high-performance suspension that gives the tank a maximum weight of 3.8 tons and payload capacity of up to 2.7 additional tons. The unparalleled modularity of the M5 means it is suitable for several applications and can even switch between applications at unprecedented speeds. The vehicle also offers outstanding integration of different payloads and ammunition types for multiple combat scenarios. In addition, the sensor array, dubbed FLIR 360-degree perception technology, gives the unmanned vehicle increased flexibility during critical missions. And although it is not as reliable as human perception, the system sensor's algorithms can work in challenging conditions like fog, sun glares, and low visibility. Interestingly, the tank makes up for the lack of a human pilot with greater resilience, modules that work separately, and operating silently without producing much noise. Modular Design The Ripsaw M5 tank is configured to work with independent modules, as the lower propelling module, where the motor and the tracks are fitted, functions independently from the top section, where the weapon systems, communication systems, and the environmental awareness sensors are housed. This lower module can be adjusted on the fly to provide additional support according to the terrain conditions where the vehicle is meant to operate, and can be configured with a mine plow, a ground penetrating radar, an IED defeat roller, or a mine clearing line charge. Meanwhile, the top module can be a turret with a medium caliber cannon, a crow's javelin, or even an anti-aircraft gun. These modular systems can be switched on the fly, making the M5 one of the most versatile combat armor solutions on the planet. Even more, having a modular setup allows the M5 to continue to function even under the most grueling situations. Suppose the vehicle is sent on a scouting operation ahead of a manned armored vehicle unit. As the M5 encounters and engages enemy armor, its automated systems can withstand much more damage than the human crew of a manned vehicle would be able to resist. Furthermore, if the M5 becomes heavily damaged and its lower module is destroyed, its independent weapon module can continue to operate, regardless of the damage to the other module. This feature is highly significant, as the damaged tank can continue providing cover for the other manned vehicles, and can even destroy targets when partially destroyed itself, as opposed to a manned vehicle under the same circumstances, which would already be out of combat. This way, if the tank is operating with an anti-aircraft module, the system can continue providing anti-aircraft support, even if its mobility module is disabled, and it can also cover soldiers in the area for a longer time, as all of its systems must be disabled to completely take it out of the fight. If armored combat vehicle technology keeps moving in an unmanned direction, the M5 will soon become a remarkable asset for the US military, and pave the way for a new generation of tank warfare in the near future. Thank you for watching my video. Do you think unmanned warfare is the way of the future? Share your thoughts in the comment section below. And remember to share, like, and subscribe for more exciting history-inspired content in our Dark Documentaries channels. Stay tuned.